Okay. Next. Uh, Gamaa, your answers, please. To use, have used, having used, using. Answers, Ali. Um. I can okay. For thousands uh, of years, people in the Americans. What, what is this, Ali? What's this part? Uh, just a phrase. I think. Introductory. Yes. In introductory phrase. Introductory phrase. Introductory phrase, comma, and after that we should have a. Um, a subject, uh, and, and, uh, and a verb. Very good. Say. And this verb should be what? Finite. Finite verb, normal verb. If we go to the choices to use, is, is this a verb? Is this finite verb or a non-finite? No, this no, non finite None? Finite. Yani it's not a verb. It looks like a verb, but it's not a verb. Because it's preceded by two. Can I say I to use or no. I use? I use. I use. I need a finite verb. Okay. The same thing here. Having and using. Both of them are? Finite. Non-finite, sorry. Non-finite. Mm -hmm. Can I say I playing? No. Or I play? I play. I play because the subject needs a finite what? Uh, uh, finite, uh, a finite verb. V very good. So, where is the subject here? Uh, uh, the, uh, no, I'm not sure, but it's Americans. Is it I'm people sure. or Americas? Americans. If we want to get the simple subject, Ali. We need to get rid of three things. What are those? Oh. Prepositional phrases, uh, relative yeah, uh, phrases, clauses. These are the separators. You can have a subject, right? And the verb yes. is away from it. And there are separators. Those separators can be prepositional. Mm. Phrases and the prepositional phrases start in with a prep of, by, whatever. You need to get rid oh. of them. Uh, it also can be a relative clause. A relative clause, Leia start starts with that. Who, whom, whose, which. If you have a relative clause, so you have to eliminate it in order to know the subject and then match it with a verb. And number three, but this is number one, the first separator, prepositional phrases, trim them, get rid of them. Number two, any relative clause, get rid of it. And number three, any interrupter between two commas, between two dashes, between two hyphens, you need to get rid of that. Then you can match the subject with the verb. Mm. So here, uh, where is the subject? People or Americas? People. People. Because in the Americas is what? Uh, is a, uh, what it was? Proposition. Very good. Propositional. Uh, Prepositional phrase. So the subject is what? So six people. Is there a verb here? For, for, for no. people? No. Since there is no verb, I should choose a what? Finite verb. A finite verb, which is a... B. Uh, uh, yeah, B. Have use. This is the only finite the fine verb. verb. Top, does anyone remember? We solved the problem uh, with finite and non-finite. Does anyone remember what is the tense? Why why we used why why we used this tense and what's the name of the tense and why? Raise your hands if you this, know. Uh, huh? What is the tense here, Ali? Uh, um, but um, but, but 
past perfect progressive لا it's not نور الدريم نور do you know it's present perfect bravo just a sec I will I will write it here this is the present perfect and what we only have used have or has plus past participle this is present oh, I'm so sorry present perfect okay why where is the clue here that we huh Bravo, for thousands of years so this action happened in the past but lasted for some a some time for some time that's why we used the present perfect yani masalan um muhammad salah space for rome for two years can i say here muhammad salah played or has played for roma that's a team for two years what do you think this is past simple and this is present perfect i want ali thank you noor ali what do you think the answer is ali ali disappeared ali fathi Ziad? No, yes, yes. <clears throat> yes, Ziad, what do you think? Can we use the, the think, past simple? Uh, no, I think it has played because uh, he plays for Roman extended for two years. Yes, for two years. So we have here extended yes, so, so use time <laughs> in the past. So we have to use the yeah, present, present perfect. perfect. Very good. طبعا هي القصة هنا ما كانتش تنسز يا جماعة. ده كان finite ون ون finite. But it's a good chance to remember the present perfect. The action started in the past and lasted for extended a time.